So back to the topic of permutations and combination. In the last two or three lessons, we talk about permutations. What is permutation? Again, let's quickly recap. Uh, let's say we have uh, three people, or let, let's take just three colors. But again, let's take three people since we need to compare it with com combinations. So we have three people, Ali, Anam, and Saad. Okay, so if the question is, arrange these three people on three seats, that means this is a question on permutation because the sequence matters. It's Ali, Anam, Saad, that's one uh, permutation. Then there's Anam, Ali, Saad, that's another way of arranging them. Then there could be uh, Saad, Anam, Ali, and then Saad, Ali, Anam. Similarly, it's going to be uh, Anam first, and then Saad, and then Ali. And it could be Ali first, and then Saad, and then Anam. So there would be actually six permutations six ways of arranging these three people on three spots or on three seats. And the formula for that is 3P3, three people, three seats, or three factorial, or we can use the basic counting principle. Uh, we have three contenders for the first seat, then two contenders for the second seat, then one contender for the third seat. So that's going to be three times two times one. And all of that equals to six. So there is six ways of arranging Ali, Anam, and Saad uh, on three seats. So that would be a question on combination. Now, when we, sorry, that would be a case of uh, permutations. Okay. Now we talk about combinations. Combination mein kya hota hai? Ke now in combinations, you are actually talking about a group. So if Ali, Anam, and Saad are, let's say, in a reading group, so then it's Ali, Anam, and Saad is just one combination. It's They, they don't make six combinations. They just make one single group. So then you won't say that Ali, Anam, Saad is in a group or Saad, Ali, Anam is in the group. Then the sequence does not matter. So when you're talking about selection or grouping, That means that that's a question on combination. So that's why 3C3 is actually 1. Okay, moving on. Also, let's quickly discuss the formulas for permutation and combination just in case. So if it's NPR, the formula is N factorial over N minus R factorial. So if it's, let's say, 4P2, uh, let's make it 3. Then it's going to be 4 factorial over uh, 4 minus 3, which is 1 factorial. So that's going to be 4 factorial. 4 factorial over 1 factorial is just 4 factorial. And the formula for NCR is N factorial over R factorial times N minus R factorial. So 5C3 should be equals to 5 factorial upon 3 factorial times 5 minus 3 factorial, which is 2 factorial. Okay. 
Let's take a look at a few example questions for combination. So, the question is, your, the start of the question mentions 10 students. Part A says, arrange four students in a row. Arrange four out of these 10 students in a row. Or there are four seats available. How many arrangements are possible of these 10 people? So that would mean either 10 people available for four spots, 10 P4, or you use the counting principle, 10 contenders for the first one, nine for the second one, eight, and then seven. 10 times nine times eight times seven, that gives the same answer as 10 P4. Okay. Part B is select four people out of these 10 people to play a tennis match. So now four people have to be selected. So now the arrangement does not matter. So this is a question on combination. So now you're going to write 10 C4. And just enter that in your calculator and whatever is the answer for that is the number of selections possible. Okay. Next question. In a club, there are 12 members. Including a president. A secretary, a delegation of four member is to be chosen. So chosen shows that it's a question on combination and not arrangement. To attend a conference. How many ways that this can be done if both president and secretary have to be included in the delegation of or in those four in the group of those four people? Both President and secretary are selected or included. Okay, so the president gets selected, he gets one spot. The secretary gets selected, he gets one spot. Two spots are left and 10 people are left to be selected. So one times one times 12 C, uh, sorry, 10 C2. So this would be 10 C2. So one times one times 10 C2. I don't have a calculator. So 10, just enter 10 C2 in the calculator and get the answer. Part B is one of them is included, but not both.
Okay. So either the president gets selected or the secretary gets selected. So we can do it in two ways. So let's select the president. And then three spots are left. So 12 are the total number of people take away president. President is in the group. Also take away secretary. Secretary is not to be included. So then 12 minus 2 is 10. 10 people are left. Three spots are left. So 10 C3. So this is 1 times 10 C3. And then there's also this case. Secretary gets selected. President is not in the group. So 10 are left, 10 C3. So another plus one times 10 C3. Or you can do two times 10 C3. That would give the same answer. So whatever is the result of this sum and product, that's the answer. Okay, part C is none of them are included. So president is not to be selected in that committee of four people and neither is the secretary. Both are excluded. So then we have 10 contenders for four spots. And they are being selected, not arranged. So that's going to be 10 C4. And lastly, it's given two members do not get along. How many selections are possible? In which both are not selected together. Okay. Given two members don't get along, how many selections are possible in which both are not selected together? So, a case le lete hain jis mein ye dono uh, ladne wale log nahi include karenge. So, that gives us 10 people that have to be chosen for four spots. So, that's going to be 10 C4. So, first case is both are not selected. So that's going to be 10 people available for four sports. So 10 C4. Okay. Now let's include one of the person. One is included. So Voto Agya. He has one spot or she has one stop for times. Three are left. Up 12 may say one to agya. Or one ko hamne nikal diya because now that other person cannot be in this group because the other uh, ladaka person is in it. So the next person cannot be in it. So 12 minus 2 is 10. So you have 10 contenders now for the three spots left. So 10 C3. And then again, the other one is included. This is the case, both are not selected, one is included, and the other one is included, or is selected. So he has one spot reserved, and then take away another one because the other one is not included now in times 10 C3. So the answer should be 10 C4 plus 10 C3 plus 10 C3. 
or you can also do 10C4 plus 2 times 10C3. Okay, next question. Team of five people is to be selected. And it must contain Three males, and two females. Total available people. are eight male and seven female. How many different teams can be selected? Okay, so five people team needs to be selected. Three have to be male, two have to be female. That, that is a condition. And there are total eight males available and seven female available. So then how many teams can be made? Okay, so three spots are reserved for male. And two spots are reserved for female. then how many selections are possible? So, okay, we have eight males available for three spots. So that's going to be eight C three times seven female available for two slots. So seven C two, this would be the answer. It says here that this must be equals to one, one, seven, six. So there are one, one, seven, six teams that can be made in the given scenario. Okay, I think it's time to start the worksheet now. Okay. The digits of the number 1, 2, 2, 3, 6, 7, 8 can be arranged to give many different seven digit number. It says arrangement. So that is your hint that you have to use NPR and not NCR. Secondly, of course, if they're talking about seven digit number, then the arrangement matters. It matters if it's going to be 72 or it's going to be 27 at the start. So the placement matters. So again, that's a question on arrangement. So that's a question on permutation. Find how many different seven digit number can be made if there are no restrictions on the order of the digit. So seven digits, seven positions, so it's going to be either seven times six times five, blah, 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 times one, or seven P seven or seven factorial. So I'm writing seven P seven, seven numbers available at for seven spots. So seven P seven 
upon since there is repetitive two. So you have to divide this with there are two repetitions. So you divide it with two factorial or two P2. So this could also be seven factorial over two factorial. What's the answer to that? It is five two five two zero. Part two. Digits one three seven in any order are next to each other. So that's a grouping case. So let's group one three seven together. One three seven. So this is three factorial arrangements or three p three arrangements. I'm writing three p three. We're making it a single group with arrangements 3p3. So let's consider it as a single number now. So take away three numbers from the original uh, seven numbers. That's four numbers left. So I'm writing one, two, three, four. So that's a total of five numbers left now. So if we're considering this as a group. So one, two, three, four, five. Arranging five numbers on five spots gives us 5p5 or 5 factorial. So 5p5 times the first box that I've made is 3 factorial or 3p3. And again, we have a repetitive 2. So 2 factorial because there are 2 repetitions. 2 and 2 are being repeated. So 2p2 or 2 factorial. This is 360. These seven digits numbers are even. Okay. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So if it's even, this can be two or another two or six or eight. So we have four contenders for this spot. So you can write four here or even four P1. So four contenders for the last spot and then take away one number at the end. So that leaves us with six numbers and six available spots. So six P6 times four divided by the repetitions in the question, which is two. So 2 factorial or 2p2. This gives 1440. Question 2. In a certain hotel, the lock on the door to each room can be opened by inserting a key card. The key card can be inserted only one way around. The card has a pattern of holes punched in it. The card has four columns, like one, two, three, four, and each column can have either one hole, two holes, three holes, or four holes. So we can see this column has two holes in it. This one has one in it. This one has three holes in it. And this one has three holes in it. So one hole is two, two, three, or four in each row. Each column has eight different positions for holes. So eight possible positions. Hai. 
लेकिन इनमें से या एक पांच होगा या कोई से भी दो या कोई से भी तीन या कोई से भी चार द डायग्राम इलेस्ट्रेट वन पर्टिकुलर की कार्ड विथ थ्री होल्स पांच इन द फर्स्ट कॉलम थ्री इन द सेकेंड वन इन दर्ड एंड टू इन द फोर्थ शो दैट द नंबर ऑफ डिफरेंट वेज इन विच अ कॉलम कुड हैव एग्जैक्टली टू होल्स इज ट्वेंटी एट okay so they are saying that show that there are 20 ways of having only two uh, punches in a row in a column sorry like this is one way of having two punches in a row let me show you another one what about what if this was punched and this was punched that's also another way of having just two boxes punched in that row also here's another case this is punch and let's say this is punch so that's another way of having two of the boxes punch so they're saying that show that there are 28 such um possibilities in which just two of these eight boxes are punch okay first we we have to establish that is this a question on arrangement that means we use we would use p or is it a question on selection so then we would use c so to distinguish we need to establish whether sequence of the punches matter like if this is punched and this is punched would it matter if this is punched first and this is punched later since these are just holes their arrangement do not matter it's just one arrangement that this one is punched and this one is punched agar ye koi color hota let's say this one would have this one was red and this one was blue phir arrangement matter karta ek upar wala red hai niche wala blue hai lekin agar ye swap ho jate upar wala blue ho jata aur niche wala red ho jata to phir hum kehte hain ye two different arrangements are but right now since they're just holes so it's just one arrangement so this is a question on uh, combinations c not permutations so two holes should be punched out of the available how many holes do we have how many spaces do we have 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 so eight spots are available two need to be punched how many combinations are possible a c 2 so the answer for the first one should be a c 2 28 so we have shown that there are 28 ways of punching two holes in a column of eight spots part to find how many different pattern of holes can be punched in a column okay so in a column you can have one hole punched or in a column you can have two holes punched or in a column you can have three holes punched or in a column you can have four holes punched so how many different patterns of holes can be punched in one column so let's consider one hole can be punched so how many cases do we have of that eight spots available only one of the spot has to be punched so that's going to be 8c1 so if one hole is punched that's going to be 8c1 or if two holes are punched or means plus then it's 8c2 or if three holes are punched it's going to be 8c3 or if four holes are punched then it's going to be 8c4 so find this sum and that should be the answer okay 
part three. How many different possible key cards are there? This gives 162. Answer for part two. Okay. How many different possible key cards are there? So that means now we have to account for all four rows. Iski bhi baat ho rie, iski bhi baat ho rie, iski bhi baat ho rie, iski bhi baat ho rie. We know that in one of the columns, there can be 162 uh, ways of punching holes in one of the columns. And we have four such columns. So using basic counting principle, first row can be uh, done in 162 ways. Second row can also be done in 162 ways. Third row can also be done in 162 ways. And the last row can also be done in 162 ways. So this is going to be 162 power 4. So there are 162 power 4 possible key cards that can be made. Okay, moving on to question number three. A committee of five people is to be chosen from six men and four women. In how many different ways can this be done? Okay. Chosen is your hint that it's NCR and not NPR. Okay. If there must be three men and two women on the committee. Okay. So three men on each other. So six men are available. So that's going to be six C3. Times four women are available and two can be selected. So times 4C2. 6C3 times 4C2 is 120. Part two. If there must be more men than women on the committee. Men should be more. So, for, for in the first case, we're going to say that all of them are men. One, two, three, four, five. So, all five are men. So, that's going to be 6C5. Because we have six available men for five spots. So, 6C5. Or... Let's say four men and one woman. So six men are available for four spots times four women are available for one spot. Or three men, two women. Still, the number of men are more than the number of women. So, 6C3, what we did in first part, 6C3 times 4C2. So, add all these three results and that should be the answer. comes out to be 186. Part three. If there must be three men, two women, and one particular woman, Diffuses to be on the committee with one particular man. Okay. So, boy, ladai wala case hai. So, first, let's consider that both these people fighting with each other are not in the group. 
सो वन मैन मैन निकाल दिया ग्रुप से और वन वुमेन निकाल दी ग्रुप से सो नाउ वी हैव वन टू थ्री फोर फाइव स्पॉट्स अवेलेबल देर मस्ट बी थ्री मैन एंड टू वेमेन सो थ्री हैव टू बी मैन ओके एंड वी हैव फाइव मैन अवेलेबल नाउ बिकॉज बोथ दो पीपल फाइटिंग आर नॉट इन द ग्रुप सो फाइव सी थ्री टाइम्स देर आर थ्री वेमेन बिकॉज द वुमेन फाइटिंग इज नॉट इंक्लूडेड सो टाइम्स थ्री सी टू दैट्स वन ऑफ द केसेस that both the people fighting are not selected okay then we are going to say that we are going to include the fighting male but not the fighting female so that's going to be six men available and one of the women is removed the one who fights with that male so that's going to be three uh women so we're going to give one of the slot to that difficult guy ek uska slot aa gaya now we have two slots available for men and another two available for women so ये वो एक सिलेक्ट हो गया तो अब पीछे फाइव मेन रह गए सो इट्स गोइंग टू बी फाइव सी टू टाइम्स थ्री वेमेन फॉर टू स्पॉट्स सो थ्री सी टू ओके सो इसमें क्या किया है फर्स्ट वी इंक्लूडेड दैट डिफिकल्ट गाय उसका एक स्पॉट आ गया फाइव मैन रह गए फाइव में से अब टू सिलेक्ट होने सो फाइव सी टू और थ्री वेमेन है एक वो जो द वन हु फाइट्स विद दैट गाय इज नॉट इंक्लूडेड बिकॉज दे कॉन्ट बी इंक्लूडेड टुगेदर सो टाइम्स थ्री सी टू ओके अब हम क्या करेंगे ओके द लास्ट केस वुड बी दैट द वुमेन हु फाइट्स इज इंक्लूडेड सो फ्रॉम द two available spots for women one of them is given to the one who um doesn't get along with that guy and for the other spot of women we have three women available so 3c1 and then you had total six men but one of them fights with this woman who has been selected so he can't be selected so five men available for three spots so that's going to be five times sorry 5c3 okay so you find the result of this you find the result of this you find the result of this and you add all these scenarios together and you get the answer 